Would you go 50 for all of it? Morning guys. Morning. How you doing? How are you today? Doing great, how are you? Good. Good morning. Alright, I got two things for a dollar each. Okay. Your game and your leapfrog thing. There you go. And those are both new. Okay. I think I'll take these so I owe you four bucks. Oh, yeah. Yo, thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. You too. I got three of your quarter mugs. We'll just round it up to a buck to make it easy. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning. How are you doing today? Pretty good. Oh, that's cool, Iron Man. You guys got a bunch of toys. Chilly for May, but uh, <laughs> it's cool this morning. Yes, it is. <laughs> Are all the clubs three? Three each. Yeah. Okay. Got one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's 18. And I owe you three more for this. It's 21. Sounds good. Is this Rapunzel? It is, yes. Hey, Darcy. Come look at this. Who's that? Rapunzel, and then there's Anna and Elsa. This is like a reversible. I think she has that exact oh, okay. one already. You want Rapunzel? She's got two in her hands. I've got. Oh, I thought that was two. Well, there's a two and a three on it. <laughs> I didn't see the three. Which one is it? Oh, sorry. Sorry. Yeah. I don't it's, know what it's, happened there. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's it's the two. The three okay. All right. So I'm gonna see. Here's With the that, twenty-one. Okay. Five. Five total. Yeah, I got yeah, a five. Dad. I got it. I got. I'm gonna get this one for Sawyer, so. Oh wait, I don't have a five, I thought I had a five in there. There you, you go. Thank you, All sir. Right, thank you. Good luck with your sale. Thanks, take care. Morning. Hey, how you doing? Doing great, how are you? Doing wonderful. It'd be better if you help me uh, move some stuff out of my house. Let's do it, let's pull it out of the garage. Oh no, no, I meant like. Oh, you mean get rid of this stuff. <laughs> I'll see what I can do. It's a uh, brand new, never, well, we just opened so we got looked at it. No seasonings are actually in it. Oh, that's cool. But it's like mountains. Oh, this is good. Yeah, dude, I might need to help get out of this chair. <laughs> <laughs> that's been my problem, for sure. I didn't realize it was quite this low and I sat down in it. I bought a, a sofa and now I don't like it because I sink too low and I can't get up out of it. <laughs> I'm like really thinking. But everything's negotiable. Uh, I, no offer will be... Uh, Gotta get rid of stuff, huh? Yes, sir. I just don't want to have to move it back in the basement. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Math shark. I like 
Yeah, it's like a math. It's like an electronic uh, uh, calculator. Yeah, but what was it? Uh, what's the what's the term? Flashcards. Okay. Flash yeah. Card. Help my son a lot with his math. Kind of gamifies it for him, doesn't it? Yes. Yeah. Absolutely. Did you ever use your lights? No. Ruin the bottom. Uh, we we, uh, we were redoing our patio, and then we just got some lights wired in. So okay. I've got the two lights, the spice thing, the math shark, and the mask. What would you need for that? Uh, 30 bucks. Would you do 20? Yeah. Okay. I appreciate you working with me. <laughs> I'm not going to argue with anybody. There you go. Thank, right, you, thank you, sir. Good luck to you. Hey, I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Good morning. And good morning. How are you? Doing great. How are you? Good, thank you. How much is your skateboard? Ten bucks. Ten bucks. Think and about that. Okay. Any of your um, golf clubs for sale? No. Okay. Paper roller. How much are your containers? Uh, a dollar piece. Okay, I'll take all three of those. Okay. I'm going to stack them if you don't mind. That'll be easier. Yeah, for sure. That's cool. Yeah, and they stack all right. How about this guy? Um, $2. Sure. I'll keep shopping and just add it all up at the end. Okay, I'll do that. And I picked up a picture frame. Um, a dollar. Yeah, I've got one more small. What am I up to? Um, and this was made in Montana by a guy oh, in awesome. Montana. Yeah, it's handmade. Um, let me see. You're up to twenty dollars exactly. And that's counting the skateboard. Yep. Perfect. Well, that worked out perfectly. Yep. yep. You have any video games, like Nintendo or anything? No. You know, so no. You're the second person. Am I? That. Yeah. Any sports memorabilia, like red stuff? Or? Um, no, nothing like that. Okay. Unfortunately, we're not even from here, so it's... Oh, yeah? Yeah. Can you carry... Yeah, I can get it. You sure? Yeah, I think so. You... you, are you okay. Thank I you so you. much. Oh, you're welcome. Have a great day. You too. Good luck with the sale. Thank you. Thank you. Morning. Is that a Jeremy Shockey jersey? Yep. That is cool. Yep. One more room since we moved for it. Yeah. How much is this stuff right here? I've got right guard stuff, a razor, and then there's more right guard stuff the in the box. The razor is 35. It's okay. brand new. Um, Adam, you can... These are two. These are two dollars a piece. Okay. Um, I don't know what he. Adam, the the right guard in the box. Uh, those are little silver yes. cans. Yes. Just a dollar a piece. Would you go fifty for all of it? Fifty, 50 for everything but the razors. That'd be with the razor. With the razor. Yeah, fifty yeah. bucks. I think there's seven at least, or eight maybe. Two, four, six, pass, eight, eight, nine. Guard, six. Yeah, 50 bucks. Yeah, okay. okay, thank you. How much is your aquarium? Oh, that's a good question. The aquarium? It's 25. It's got all the rock and stuff in there. Too. Okay, did you ever use it? 
We did use it. Yeah, we um, we moved yeah. from Arizona. So oh yeah. We... <laughs> New shorts are a five a pair, is that right? Okay, I got three of them. What are you asking on the jersey? Uh, 25. It's actually autographed, I got the authenticity. That is cool, yeah. Would you do 20 on it? I need to do 25 on that one, so I'm selling it for somebody else. Oh, okay. You know what? I will buy it for 25. There you go. Thank you. Good luck with your sale. Hey guys, it is now Monday morning. I went to some garage sales on Saturday with my dad and Darcy and we got a lot of stuff. I was buying like crazy. It felt like every single sale I went to, I bought something. I got it all pulled out now. I'm going to show you what I found. I got some lights. I got two of these new in the box, Gamma Sonic Solar Lights. Uh, these were part of a bulk buy, so I might have $5 into them. Got this board game, Ticket to Ride. I've actually played this before. Really fun game. And brand new, I think it's not cheap. It's like $35, $40, bucks, something like that. I only paid a dollar for that. Got some shorts, new with the tags. Let's see, these are women's shorts. Ralph Lauren, 2 bucks. Got some mugs for $0.25 cents each. This one is a Kate Spade with the box. And I think it's personalized, so got to find somebody, you know, with S in the name in order to sell that one. And then, let's see, one is Dilbert. I thought this was really funny. What did I say that sounded like, tell me about your day? <laughs> and then the last one is Marvin the Martian. I got a spice rack, new in the box. I think that was five bucks. Let's see, I got brand new Ben 10 Deluxe Omnitrix toy. That was a dollar or two. Got a picture frame for a dollar. That's just something I'm going to keep. I got this Leapster 2 recharging system. And it's brand new in the box. Obviously, this is dated. I don't know how many people are still using this. But the price was, was right. I think I paid like a dollar or two for that. Got some more lights at one sale. These are um, eight pathway lights new in the box. I paid $10 for those. Got this Jeremy Shockey framed signed jersey really nice matting nice framing and everything but the fact that it's jeremy shockey might make it a little hard to sell because i don't think he's been in the nfl for a while he was a good player i don't you know he wasn't like hall of fame caliber or anything i paid 25 dollars for it which is really cheap because i'm sure you know the jersey alone is worth that so it was like the matting and the framing i'm sure that was expensive i just might have to hang on to it for a while to find the right buyer I'm not expecting to get crazy money, you know, probably somewhere in the range of like $50, $75 if I'm lucky. It does have authentication from Steiner, so that definitely helps it. Got a couple things for the new office. I thought this like letter, you know, organizer thing was kind of neat. And then this is a uh, coat rack. And I think I paid five for this one and like two or three for that one. Got this jacket for $2. The brand is Jerry. I've never heard of it, but... The quality was just really good, and it might even be my size, so I'm, I'm half tempted to keep it. That was only $2. Got some shorts, new with the tags, for $5 each. Some of the brands I've never heard of. This is Coppin. This neighborhood I went to was on a golf course, uh, a really, really nice golf course. So a lot of these people have to buy so much stuff in their country club every year, and they just can't use it all, so they sell it at their garage sale. And that's the case with this stuff. Let's see, this is walking and then we've got some calvin klein shorts yeah for five dollars each pretty hard to go wrong i got a penny skateboard for ten dollars and these do pretty well i haven't sold one in a while but i want to say brand new they're like 80 or 90 so used i could maybe get 30 or 40 bucks for it got a couple of rawlings baseballs for 50 cents each with the cubes and these are the official major league baseball so if you go buy these in the store they run about 15 16 bucks something like that maybe closer to 20 with the cube i got this norelco razor at one sale along with some right guard i think this is shaving cream no i'm sorry aerosol deodorant and then i think this is all deodorant too so i got let's see nine cans of this and seven cans of this 
and the razor i paid 50 bucks it's kind of high i haven't looked up what this is selling for yet but i think i can get at least 30 or 40 dollars for these i don't think they're going to be worth listing individually so i'll probably just do like one bulk a lot for these and one bulk a lot for these got some nice racquetball rackets on sale for a dollar each and also with that sale i got some golf clubs for three dollars each this is tailor-made rescue hybrid we've got an odyssey dual force putter here's a uh, tailor-made rack pitching wedge tailor-made super steel burner sand wedge here's a bobby jones hybrid and a tailor-made r7 sand wedge i got this waterford crystal rose on sale still with all the original foam packing and everything she had it priced originally at i think 20 it's kind of hard to see i don't know if you guys can see that and then she crossed it off and put 10 and all i did was walk up to it and look at it and she's like i'll take five for that i could tell she just wanted to get rid of stuff and be done with the sale but it is just a really cool piece not sure what it's worth but i know typically waterford crystal stuff isn't very cheap and if this was just loose I don't think I would have messed with it, but the fact that it has all of the original foam packing and everything, I think will help it keep really protected and make it an easier uh, shipping job. So I went ahead and got that for five bucks. I got this massive cargo, like rooftop carrier thing. Uh, the brand is Tool or Tooley. I'm not totally sure how to pronounce that. T-H-U-L-E. He had it priced at 60. And once again, I just like walked up and looked at it and he was like, I'll do 50 on that. He just wanted to get rid of it. These are really expensive new. He said he spent $400 on it and I don't doubt it. I know that brand of cargo carrier is pretty pricey. Only downfall is that he said he doesn't have the key. So I guess there's a key that goes in here to like lock these in place. So I might have to buy a key for it or just try to sell it a little cheaper. I think worst case scenario, I should be able to get a hundred bucks for that. Also from this guy, I saw this when I was walking out to the car and then I thought about it and I, I ran back and bought it. This is an easy up instant shelter. And I think this is the first one I've seen at a garage sale that's actually from the brand easy up. Um, so I know it's made well. They have a lot of like, you know, cheap knockoff, like pop-up tents that are just crap. Uh, but I think this is a pretty good one. Brand new. These run about 150 bucks, something like that. And he said he only used it a couple times. Paid $25 for it. That's also something that I'm going to keep. That is it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.